Hey dudes, what's going on? It is your pal Keith, and I am live in the control room at Essex Recording Studios just outside London in England, South End on Sea to be precise. I've got a super, super rare John Petrucci USA seven string guitar to share with you all today. If you're new to the channel, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and come out and hang out with your buddy Keith. We're going to look at some awesome guitars from all around the world that I show up close. So you know what it's like holding it in your very own hands. As close as it gets, guys. Well, what can we say about this guitar? This came to us from a friend of the studio who has a monster amp collection out in London. Uh, really cool guy. Phenomenal instrument collection, amp collection. And... He said, you know what? I've got this laying around. What do you think about it? I said, oh yeah, must have it. The color is incredible. It's the only example I can find in the world finished in this color. It's olive gold sparkle. And this thing blings like a disco ball. It is freaking awesome. I can't think of something cooler to have on stage than a finish like this that just... I don't care where you are in the room, you're you're going to see it. This is going to stand out and it doesn't look tacky in the slightest. It looks it looks rock star. It just looks super pro, super rock star in every single way. Um these guitars, if you haven't had one in your hands, very well balanced and is, you know, plenty of people would argue is from the greatest guitar player in the world. I mean, John Petrucci, if you don't know who he is, I order you to go on to, to leave my YouTube channel immediately and go watch uh, some Dream Theater and go watch his instructional um, movie from the 90s. Man, that video that he did is uh, so influential for an entire generation of guitarists. I remember my friend, I think he paid like $90 for the VHS tape of John Petrucci's instructional video. He was the bass player in the band. I was a guitarist and he wanted me to get better. And like, that was the best thing he could think of to contribute. He's like, man, I'm, you know, this guy's like the greatest guitar player. Watch the video. You'll get better. You do the exercises in that video. You will be a better guitar player virtually overnight. It's super efficient, super effective. And yeah. So, go check it out. Now, this guitar has some beautiful lines. You have beautiful beveled edges, this deep cut to the side, which is really cool. So if, you, if you catch it in a photo at, like, the wrong angle, it looks, like, super dramatic and, and weird, and, like, part of the guitar is missing, maybe. But it's not. I'm telling you, in person, it gives really good contrast, and obviously, this is for you know, ergonomics for your forearm. And just look at how, it looks like there's a billion ants on this thing. Look, if, like, if you just hold this static, okay, it looks super cool. But the minute you start to move, look at how animated the body looks. It looks like there's a billion ants crawling around. And that's why this guitar looks so cool on stage, because you're going to be moving... The audience is going to be moving. They better be moving. Uh, yeah, so this is going to look like a million bucks. These knobs, really cool. They've got this textured, rubbered, rubberized kind of grip. That's, again, super pro. Extra little attention to detail. Love it. Seven-string Music Man tremolo. And then you've got his signature DiMarzio pickups. But... Seven string versions of them. Holy smokes. Beautiful rosewood fretboard. And I love the matching headstock. Now the back is just as pretty. In fact, you might say it's even better. Because not only... Oh, left the trim bar on there. Going for a little journey. <clears throat> there we go. So not only do you have the continuation of this beautiful olive gold limited edition finish but you've got a striking bird's eye maple neck which 
Ernie Ball Music Man is famous for. Oh, and another little nice attention to detail. Check out the gold, kind of olive gold, Goto tuners. Man, that is so cool. If you were ever, ever going to buy a seven-string Music Man guitar, I don't know how many of them they make, this is surely the one to buy. This is just epic on every level, guys. Also equipped with my favorite, a tremolo no. So what you can do, you've got three different settings here. And one locks the trem for added tuning stability. You know, if you're not going to be doing any Dimebag Daryl stuff, you don't need it. Go ahead and lock it. Perfect. Then you've got one where it acts like a top-mounted Floyd. And then you've got one setting where you can go up and down. I think I got that right. Tremolo no system. A little added bonus for you with this guitar. Condition. This thing's in excellent condition. There's a few super ultra minor marks. They're virtually indetectable because of the finish on this. There's so much variety of texture and angles and light bouncing off a million different directions off this guitar that pretty hard to find any marks. I think I saw the... I, don't know, I can't tell what that is. This is the slightest little thing. I don't even know if the phone's going to pick it up. Uh, you're not going to see it. It's in the, the lights hitting it. There's like a super tiny thing there. And then there's like, I don't know what it is. It could just be a dark spot in like the, the, the glitter or the flake. But there's kind of a, a dark spot there. I don't feel any, uh, there might be like a little ding there in the lacquer. That's all I can see, guys. I mean, this is, this is excellent. This is as good as it gets. Headstock looks phenomenal. And you get the nice Music Man molded case. Really nice. All right, dudes. That's, uh, that's another awesome guitar for you guys today. I need to go home and get some Din Din. It's dinner time for your pal Keith. I'm hungry. And uh, I haven't had much to eat today. Other than a really cool bagel that... Producer James got me from across the street. Definitely going to be getting fat here in our new studio location. There's so many awesome restaurants and takeaways here in the city center in South Bend on Sea. Otherwise, guys, there's not much else to say. Follow us on the socials. Stay safe if uh, you're still under COVID-19 lockdown. Some places seem to be opening up, closing back up again, opening up again. I don't know. Here in the UK, we're kind of going through this gradual, phased approach, and uh, so far, so good, it seems. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll catch you later. Stick around on the channel. Oh, and uh, some really cool stuff. We've got some guitars coming from quite a famous producer very soon. I'll be in the next few days, so stay tuned, and I will see you soon. Later.